In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a balloon garland. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel with my inspiring designs with me, Justine, where all I want to do is inspire you. If you're new here on my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the bell to get notified on all the decor, design, and DIY projects I do here on my channel. So if you would like to know how to make a balloon garland, please keep watching. So the first thing we are going to do is set up this balloon kit by unscrewing these clamps and putting it on both ends of the table. So the next thing is you're going to take these clear plugs and put them in each end of the transparent poles. Now when I first bought these, I was like, what the heck? How can straight poles make an arch? But for some reason it does. Now I tried putting this kit by myself because when I go on events I'm going to be by myself but obviously for some reason I could not get it so I eventually had to ask my friend to come help me. So the next thing we're going to do is blow up these balloons. Now you want to make sure you have a round shape. In order to achieve that, you kind of want to push them towards your body while airing out some air. Um, it gives them that round shape, which makes it look a lot cleaner. And then I actually tie two balloons together to create a duplet because it makes it easier to put it on an arch. Now when it comes to the confetti balloons, in order for the confetti to kind of stick to the outer side of the balloon, you have to rub it against something like cloth. I ended up rubbing it just against my shirt just because it was a lot easier to do so. So step three is applying balloon clips to the actual balloons. Now the balloon clips came with instructions to basically put one individual balloon on each clip. What I ended up doing was because I used two balloons in one duplet, I applied one balloon end to one side of the clip and another balloon end to another side. Rather than four balloons connected to the clip, it's just two and it worked out perfectly. So 
So step four is basically placing the balloons on the arch and this is probably the easiest step. All you have to do is take off one of the ends and put it straight through the balloon clip right in the middle and that's it. One thing I love about this arch kit is that you can turn the balloons and I wanted to test to see if the balloons will actually stay up and it really does. So step five is to add the small balloons with the low temperature hot glue gun and to fill in all the gaps or spaces you see in the arch. So that was my husband shooting a Nerf gun at me and my best friend in the back yelling. Gotta love them both. Stop! <laughs> so the last and final step is to decorate. Now I used the diaper cake that I did in my previous video to kinda give this a little visual of how it would look if it was a real dessert table. So if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.